Yeah, thanks, Lacey. Uh, Guy, a couple more things about this tournament. Okay? Mm -hmm. 59 mm -hmm. players, we mentioned that. Right. Very exclusive field, but also the most that they've had in tournament history. $3.6 million for the winner. That's a pretty nice paycheck. Yeah. And also, for those of you who don't follow golf, this might be a little bit in the weeds, but 700 FedEx points, okay. which is very big when you talk about the championship at the end of the year. They want to win this thing. Yeah, there's been an injection of money in prize money since the Live Tours come on, actually. And uh, all the players are pretty excited about coming to Kapalua. And it's unreal. You see these unbelievable guys that you see in the headlines week in, week out, and they're all here. Yes, unbelievable talent, but also an unbelievable course. And, and we, we, got, we got to try it out just a little bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> here we are at the Kapalua Plantation course. And as much as we are covering this tournament, Guy and I decided that wait, we, we should take some time and enjoy it ourselves, right? Yeah, that's right. And this is the only way we can enjoy it, at least on the putting course. We can at least try. Yeah. Because some of the best golfers on the planet are here enjoying one of the best courses in all of the world. All right, you going to give it a shot? I'm going to give it oh, a shot, but got. I don't have high expectations because oh. these greens are much faster and much slicker than the ones I'm normally used to. Shoes are intact. Whoa! Ooh! I'll take that. No, I'll that's take pretty that. good. That's I'll pretty good. All right. While, while Guy gets his game on, we got Max over here. He's the executive director of the century. Uh, Max, what went into the decision after the fires to, to keep this going? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, really, since uh, day one, we were resolute that we had to play on Maui. We had to play on the west side. We had to play at the plantation course. Ultimately, uh, for us to give back to the community, that's what it's all about. And we hope that we can bring inspiration uh, and recovery and rebuild uh, to the island and, and to the people. Yeah, and as much fun as it is to, to see this high level of golf, it's also about giving back, like you said, to the community and, and to the people that need it so much. And you've done a lot. Uh, tell us what, what Century has done and what you have done as well. Yeah, you know, our, our platform is really uh, one that gives back to the community. Ultimately, we want to honor the island, honor the people, uh, not only bring continued awareness, but fundraising, uh, community service, and economic impact. Uh, since the fires, uh, Century Insurance, our title partner, uh, has given $2 million uh, to help you know, folks that have been impacted by the fires. Most recently, they announced a new gift, a special initiative, a million dollars to the Maui United Way. Uh, that is intended to be used for mental health uh, for keiki that have been impacted. Yeah, what's the reception been like? Uh, it's been overwhelmingly uh, positive. And like I said, from day one, we were committed to playing. That's, of course, with the assumption that the state, the county, and most importantly, the people uh, wanted us to. And the response has been overwhelmingly positive. And, and I think people have thought, you know, if you're going to do it, it has to be done right. And I think that's exactly what's been done. Uh, and jumping off of that, sport, sports is in itself escapism. It, it's time to have some fun, right? Absolutely. It's intended to be entertainment, an opportunity to enjoy uh, sport, the outdoors with uh, you know friends and family. We're so excited about our Kama Aina program. We're also doing free tickets for fire survivors, and we're also going to do tickets and experiences inside of the ropes for first responders. All right, I got it to within tapping range. Let's see if uh, Steve Uehara, proud Damien graduate, Ooh. can do any better. All right, Steve, let's go, man. Let's go, buddy. The pressure's on. There's no money involved in this one, though. Oh, nice soft touch. Is it going to get close? I think Steve needed to eat another scoop of rice this morning. It was a little short. Steve could use some help from Michael Castillo. He's the head pro here at the Kapalua Plantation course. Uh, Michael, what are the pros going to look forward to at this course? Because it's a very unique course, right? No question. Uh, they're going to look forward to the obviously the, the beauty around here, but more or less the golf course. It's a really well-designed golf course, taking in the natural terrain of the golf course. Uh, conditions are perfect. Um, I think they're going to be really enjoying the, the greens itself, too, making a lot of putts out there. Now, this is a long golf course, but because of the winds, it was designed with the winds in mind, right? Yeah, winds and contours. You know, it's nearly 7,600 yards all the way back, which is what the guys are going to be playing. And uh, it, it doesn't play quite as long, especially with the wind and the contours of the fairways. Now, talk about the field, because you got a stellar field. Probably best field of any tournament, any time of, in the world, any time of the year. Yeah, you know, we're talking about uh, 60 of the best. Um, and uh, we have, I think, 15 players that haven't been here before. So that's good. That's exciting to see them come out and play. Yeah, and we got some local connections with Colin Morikawa, right? Absolutely. Uh, he uh, finished second last year. He's uh, hot, ready to take on the course uh, this year. And also, Colin's family has roots up in Lahaina. Yeah, I understand his grandfather uh, grew up here and had a business out here on the west side of Maui. 
All right, hopefully we can uh, have a chat with him. Thank you, Michael. Uh, and we are enjoying Kapalua, the plantation course. And don't forget, they got another course down the way called the Bay Course. So if you can come, you should come as a spectator, even a volunteer, and enjoy the century here at Kapalua.